Howdy, my name is Craig. I'm a cultivation lead at Common Citizen, and today we will be talking about the differences between sativa, indica, and hybrids. The biggest two points that I would like to make here are definitely that indica is gonna put you in the couch. So it's gonna kinda make you really relaxed and really tired. And then sativa is kinda gonna be more uplifting. So it's gonna make you more energetic and kinda make you wanna carry out and get through the day. And then with hybrid, you really get the best of both worlds. You're really calm, but you're still there and focused. Each drink can kind of have a special effect on your appetite. Um, sativa, I would say, doesn't make you as hungry or have the munchies as much. Uh, indica makes you a little bit more hungry. In a hybrid, you just kind of have a mellow appetite, you know, definitely just a normal day, you eat when you need to. So with sativa, you will have thin leaves on your physical plant, and then for indica, you would have more thick leaves, so it'll be kind of a fatter fan leaf. And then the hybrid would be more of just an average of those two. So some activities that you might want to consider while you're on Sativa would maybe be going to a concert or a movie. Um, and on Indica, you know, you might just want to sit on your couch and watch some TV and relax. Uh, in Hybrid, you know, you're just really going to have a great day. Another key factor about hybrids is that they can lean more towards the indica side or they could lean towards the sativa side or even right in the middle. It really depends on the strain and the way it was grown. 